Okay, and welcome to the new part of Dragon Age Origin. As I promised, I would uh, do a little bit of backtracking and load up an old save so I could see if I get some more information out of Kaylee. Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the Maker. Blessed are the penitents who seek his return. Blessed is the prophetess, purified by flame. May the chant reach the Maker's ears and tell him of our contrition. So let it be. Oh, I didn't see you there. I recite the Maker's blessings every day. It brings me peace in troubled times. No, no, not really. It's just... I, I don't want to bore you with this. It gives me hope that one day the Maker will hear us. That maybe I'll be forgiven and my curse will be lifted. Magic? What else? Magic causes such misery. It's dangerous and vile and wicked. The Chantry must protect the world from us. Being born with something so terrible must be a punishment. I wish I could be rid of it. That doesn't take magic. If I could, I would dedicate my life to the Chantry. But they would never take me in. Perhaps this is just something I will have to suffer through. I should go. My mentor only allows a few minutes each day for well, religious okay, contemplation. Well, okay, that was a big bore. God damn it, that, that's why I did all this backtracking. I, that was stupid for me. Oh, maybe Lily. I think Lily did some, say something. I heard about your harrowing. Oh, Congratulations. Andraste must have smiled upon you. I heard about your harrowing. Congratulations. Andraste must have smiled upon you. Ooh. It shall be done. Look, here are the, the things that I needed to find. The bookcases. Oh! Another book. Also, no. Oh, this one I took earlier on. No, that's all of the books. <clears throat> ah, that's where I need to go to, but uh, I don't want to yet. So I have a lot of exploring to do. Yeah, I, got, I know you guys want me to proceed with the game, but uh, bear with me for a second, please. I want to n see everything, get everything. Well, not everything, because that's probably not going to work, but at least get a big part of it. Also, I completely forgot to go... Oh my god, sorry guys, I, I forgot something. I really forgot something. Go somewhere around here. It shall be done. See? Told you I forgot something. This book. Sorry, you have to bear with me again. Oh, it's you. I hear Irving's looking for you. Ah, oh, it's great to see you. It's always sad. Ah, oh, it's great to see you. Yeah, it's, it's great always to see you. sad when an I'd avoid Leora if I were you. She's been rather testy lately. Who knows? I'm not going to ask her why she's irritable. Women hate those kind of questions. Hope you're having a good day. Oh, it's you. I hear Irving's looking for you. Ah, this is infuriating. Another batch destroyed. Say, well, I don't know. He might have gone to the privy. The Trank will still function like us. Mostly. I hope he still has some cinnabar lying around. Damn it.
Ooh, another room that I didn't check out. Well, remember that in my previous game when I made a mistake and pressed the uh, F9 button, which would load a quick slot, I had a. Um, I shall do it. A little uh, head on. And it seems. You look well. That's wonderful. I was thrown up for a full week after my harrowing. It's delirium that does that, I think. So, I hope. I can find that one back. Hey, Greetings. Tyler. I'm glad your harrowing went well. Some Templars I know discuss such things with glee. I don't share their enthusiasm. I try to serve the Maker first and foremost. As long as I am guided by his commandments, I cannot go wrong. Honestly, I've never seen an abomination, or been called on to slay one. Gregor would have guided me. Something must happen, but what if it's not obvious? Could abominations be walking among us right now? This is still new to me. Maybe one day I'll be as dedicated and driven as Knight Commander Gregor. You must be busy. Perhaps we can talk another time. I hope you are well. Well, Colin is, if I'm correctly, one of the companions that will travel with- Whoa! I found a jackpot. Ah, there you are. You are to be moved out of the apprentice's dormitory and these are to be your new quarters. Oh, nice. And again, something happened with the sound. Ah, there you are. You are to be moved out of the apprentice's dormitory and these are to be your new quarters. The Tranquil will move your belongings this afternoon. Go on, make yourself comfortable. So, the Tranquil are sort of like the slaves of the mages? It's a little bit harsh, don't you think? I could have picked up my stuff myself, but hey. If I got myself an own slave, then... You don't hear me, uh, Complaining. But, I wanted a room for my own. Why do I have to share my room with all these other dudes? Irving wants to see you. Get going. Well, you could have said that normally. Don't have to yell at me. Everyone's so happy for you. Yeah, right. Still no more no more books. That way was the colon. Oh, excuse me, I didn't hear you come in. I'm sorry, I'm terribly busy right now. I have to prepare the room before the Grey Warden is done at his meeting with Irving. Yes, Duncan his name is. He must be here to talk to Irving about something important. You know, I almost became a Grey Warden once. There were several of us chosen, though the Grey Wardens only wanted one recruit. Uh, they only ever have one mage, you see. I think they thought I was the best candidate, but I was young and foolish, and I said I wasn't interested. They picked someone else instead, and that was that. I've regretted it ever since. Ah, oh, well, I should get back to my work. Yeah, right. You were... Whatever. Sorry guys, if only I'm doing is collecting information and other stuff. But I really don't want to miss out on the, the important stuff of this game. 
probably already drank. They say you passed your harrowing. You must be happy. I think someone's here to speak to you, Senior Torren. Hello. Congratulations on your harrowing last night. Good work. Oh, the Fraternities of the Enchanters. You probably haven't heard of them. It's best not to get tangled up in circle politics. More trouble than it's worth, really. Hmm. Uh, oh, they're found in all circles throughout Thedas. Groups of enchanters who hold similar viewpoints, who band together to make their voices heard. The most influential fraternity are the Equitarians. They are moderates and believe in a code of conduct that all majors should adhere to. Then there are the Chantry apologists, the loyalists. The Chantry says something and they follow it to the letter. The Lucrosians just want to make money. And the isolationists would like us all to be hermits and live on an island. Then of course there are the Libertarians. They want more power for the Circle, more autonomy. If I had to, I'd say I was an Equitarian, but I ducked out of the fray a long time ago. Most of the senior enchanters are Equitarians. Irving, Wynne, Sweeney. Ulred's a Libertarian, and a loud one at that. Ah, uh, majors have enough opposition from the outside without tearing our circles apart with infighting. But what can you do? An idealist, I see. Well... If you're going to change the world, you should get started immediately. Lots of world to cover. Hello, were you looking for something? Oh, the fraternities. Groups of mages with a common agenda. <sighs> I think we should all be isolationists. Stay in some remote mountain town far away from the mundanes who hate us. They'll never learn that. They don't want to. I'd go hide alone in the wilds if I could. But you know they just brand me an apostate and hunt me down. There is no leaving the circle. It's till death do us part. Romantic, isn't it? If you leave the circle, you become an apostate. And the punishment for leaving is death. Pretty grim, huh? I've heard of hedge witches who've managed to survive on their own, eluding the circle for a lifetime. But if the Templars discover them, well, you know what happens. Then there are stories about the Dalish elf clans having great magic. Why did but who knows what's they show truth and what's fiction when it comes to the Dalish? I'm Njal, a mage just like you. I've seen you around, haven't I? I must have. If you leave the circle, you become an apostate, and the punishment for leaving is death. Let's see Pretty if grim, the camera huh? sticks with him now. The grass is always greener on the other side, isn't it? And it's better go to again. never be brought to the circle than to try to escape it. I wouldn't risk it, though. I've heard of hedge witches who've managed to survive on their own, eluding the circle Here for a lifetime. Again. But if the Templars discover what the hell's them, well, going on? you know what happens. Then there are stories about the Dalish elf clans having great magic. But who knows what's truth and what's fiction when it comes to the Dalish? All right. Have a good day. It was that was really weird. And it seems that I finally get some more books. Some more information about the entire game, which is uh, pretty useful. And uh, well, let's continue and see if uh, we can find some more. Uh, let's see. Um, Owain is in charge of the stock room. Ah, it's you again. Or at least I think it is. You all look the same to me. I'm not good at talking. Too much chatter makes my head throb. Don't you have lessons to get to? Shoo! Uh, well, you could be a little bit friendlier for all I care, but no. 
Well, which means I went a full circle and now let's head towards uh, my objective. But uh, my time is already almost up, so when I get to the point, I will, uh, yeah, that's right here, right here. And uh, let's say I will see you guys in the next video of Dragon Age Origin in part 7. Goodbye.